Hello, my name is Christine Walgus and I'm with the National Weather Service Forecast Office in Paducah, Kentucky. Today we're going to be talking about the dangers of nighttime and off-season tornadoes. As we head into the fall season, we are entering a period of time where most people think tornadoes are not very common. However, the fall season marks our secondary severe weather season, as you can see from this graph, showing the number of tornadoes in our region by month. You can clearly see a spike in tornadoes during the fall months. Here is a graph showing when tornadoes have occurred in our region by time. Tornadoes can happen at any time of the day, but the majority of all tornadoes occur in the late afternoon through early evening hours. In fact, 55% of the tornadoes have occurred between the hours of 3 p.m. and 9 p.m. However, remember, in the fall and winter, it gets dark much earlier, making it difficult to see tornadoes. Over the past century, the tornado death rate has declined, especially since the mid-1970s, due in part to improved forecasting technology, Doppler radar, and warning systems. The one exception to this was the record-setting number of deaths in 2011. However, researchers indicate that the decline in nighttime tornado death rates have not mirrored the rates shown for daytime tornadoes. From 1950 through 2005, Research indicates that nighttime tornadoes were 2.5 times more likely to kill people than daytime tornadoes. So let's take a look at our local tornado statistics. Since 1996, there have been a total of 55 deaths from tornadoes in our region. However, 40 of these 55 deaths occurred during the nighttime hours, which is a staggering 70% of the total amount of deaths. In addition, 80% of the deaths occurred in mobile homes and 80% of the deaths occurred in the off-season months of November, January, and February, not in the spring or early summer when many people expect to see tornadoes.